best of, one of the world's largest Queen tribute bands, Killer Queen, is rocking the U.S. once again. And the band is on tour. They're going to make a stop at the Temple Theater in Tacoma this Saturday. So let's get a little preview of what you'll hear. Listen to this. I just wanted to keep going. This is legit. Oh my goodness. So good. Yeah. yeah. Joining us to talk all about the show is Patrick Myers, the lead singer of Killer Queen, assuming the role of the legendary Freddie Mercury. Patrick, nice to have you with us this morning. Hey, thanks for having me. It's great to have you with us. So you're in you're in you're in costume this morning, ready to go for the show. How did you find yourself in the role of the legendary Freddie Mercury? And what is it like to portray such an iconic artist? Uh, well, it, how, how it all happened was we were students at London University, which is the same university Queen met at, and uh, we got the news that Freddie had died um, as we just left home. We just met each other, just become friends at college, and we thought we started singing songs to each other, basically, at, at first. Um, and then that led to thinking maybe we could put on a concert, and I was studying acting at the time, so I thought, let's all dress up and do it, you know, like we're Queen, because tributes didn't really exist when we started. So we were sort of like the first, one of the first on the people to do that sort of thing. Um, and then it, that one concert we did took off, and then we ended up playing um, the West End, like the, which is the Broadway in England. Um, and then started eventually, a few years down the road, started doing the same arenas that Queen did uh, with Freddie back in the day, which is amazing. Mm. So it's a brilliant, fun thing to do. Freddie Mercury, um, they're big boots to try and even go anywhere near. That's that's as well saying from the off, but. Um, but really, Freddie is such a—he's so full of fun on stage. He's so full of energy, um, and 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 artistry and mischief and fun and, and all of that. It's it's a real pleasure as a performer to just jump into that with those amazing songs. The songs are absolutely extraordinary. Um, there are so many songs over so many different eras that the people over so many different generations just adore. We get people in their seven to seventy coming to our show. Um, whole families come. Um, and there's a lot of them these days, they all dress up as Freddy, <laughs> which is great fun. <laughs> uh, so the, the show is, is is a huge amount of fun. There's so much emotion. Like, songs like We Will Rock You, We Are The Champions, Beam Her Out. So you can't beat those songs. Yeah. It sounds like it's going to be a lot of fun. And it's really good to hear about your band's beginning. It sounds like you really followed Queen's footsteps. And, you know, you went to the same school and performed at the same venues. Do you have a favorite Queen song to perform? I know you just mentioned some of the really popular ones, but do you have a favorite? Yeah, I love. I, I have I, 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 lots of favorites, but, but they all do different things to me. Sort of like there's a song called "Days of Our Lives," uh, which which was uh, released back in the end of '91 after Freddie had died, um, and that's a beautiful song. It was a Roger Taylor song, um, so I love performing that song. But I, I, I tell you, I mean. <clears throat> that you can't beat the buzz of perform performing a song like those songs I mentioned, like Behemoth Rhapsody, uh, mm. Rock You and Champions. They're so amazingly powerful for an audience. Um, but there's so many great songs to just have fun with, like Don't Stop Me Now, uh, Somebody to Love, Under Pressure, Another One Must Have Just Crazy Thing I Love. There's so many great songs that the audience just go wild for. Um, so the whole evening is really, sort of, it's like giving out Christmas presents. You know? <laughs> it's, 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 it's really, it's a pleasure. I like how you put that. It's like giving out Christmas presents. So for people that are going yeah. to the show, thinking about going to the show in Tacoma this weekend at the Temple Theater, what can they expect from you guys? We've got a great lighting uh, set up. Uh, we've got a lot of visual effects and pyrotechnics. We've got um, all these great songs, lots of costume changes. We try to be as engaging for an audience as possible uh, and fun. People people uh, often write that after they've seen the show, that was so much fun. I had so much fun there. Uh, and as I say, they bring the whole families along with them. Um, and it's great to see these little mini Freddies in the audience <laughs> with a little white singlet on or, yeah. or the yellow jacket. Um, uh, we, we, the uh, merchandise store, we've got their sales moustaches too. So we have a large, huge sections of the audience suddenly have aviator shades and moustaches on by the time they take their seats, which is great because you've got this sea of Freddies out there, <laughs> which is uh, which is really entertaining. But everyone, everyone has just lets their hair down and rocks out. It has a great evening. 
Sounds like a great time. It really, does, right? yeah. Just to rock yeah. out. And, oh, so much fun. Thank you so much, Patrick. Good luck to you all this weekend. Hey, it's been a pleasure. Mm -hmm. Well, if you want more information and if you want to get tickets to Killer Queen's show on Saturday, we made it easy for you. Scan the QR code on your screen. That'll take you directly to comonews.com slash hotlinks. From there, you'll see a link to buy tickets. And I love how he just kind of embodies Freddie Mercury. I do too. He has that energy. Looking at the pictures of him performing on stage, it looks like you're looking at the real thing. And I have to imagine, you know, as a performer sitting up on stage performing some of these legendary songs from, from Queen, looking out and seeing other people dressed up like you yeah. kind of gives you a little bit like fuel motivation. as you're, yeah, a little motivation while you're on stage. Uh, but you think about the lights, you think about the costumes, you mm -hmm. think about all the great songs That's and it, what yeah. a legendary band Queen is. Um, and just paying homage to a, a really great performer, yeah. Freddie Mercury. That's yeah. going to be fun. Yeah.